hello everyone it's been a while since my last video um today i will be briefly talking about my yoga teacher training it's important as to why i changed my practice my personal practice um i do have some products here that i purchased from amazon they are the mark stevens sequencing deck see beautiful dancers pose and the yoga adjustment deck you can see it's nice reverse warrior um so a little bit about my yoga teacher training i started my yoga teacher training in march of this year i enrolled in the in-person class because with yoga it's very hands-on so i wanted to really get that experience covid we ended up doing everything online so as far as our hands-on and adjust we didn't really get an experience to um fill those pressure points and have those um placements as far as my private practice i do go to core power yoga i love their c2 class and their hpf class actually hpf is my favorite um what we learn for our yoga teacher training is very 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 much based on our c1 is our introdu introductory sequence for core power in general and it's very redundant there's really little room to add on or do any sort of type of variation we have moments in class like say for instance when we're doing our crow pose or we'll take some some yogi fun and just work on some inversions that we've been practicing but there we're usually there from about five to ten breaths so that doesn't really give you much time. kind of practice i took it upon myself to really get kind of interested in asana practice and i believe that the stronger that your asana is then the stronger it will be in your vinyasa or your ashtanga or any form of yoga, gentle yoga, restorative yoga that you feel comfortable doing. It's very rooted in your asana practice. So what I like to do is I take my yoga deck and I already have a couple of poses that I really wanted to try out. I love this deck because it has a a matching pair for the pose that you're looking to do. And it's makes me so happy because it just does. <laughs> and as you can see, the adjusts have a black and white filter over it compared to this one, which is the same color. The yoga sequencing deck, it gives you the Sanskrit name and then it also gives you the, the English name it lets you know what part of the series that you're in as well so this is a back bend and say for instance if you're doing a downward facing tree pose or this, this is a handstand <laughs> handstand pose um this is an arm support so it lets you know what part of the sequence that you are working on for the yoga sequencing deck, it, it comes with a picture and then it lets you know how to best prep for this pose. It gives you some ideas on how to open up the, the posture so that you can breathe effectively and so that you can get the most out of it safely. It teaches you how to safely get into the pose, how to safely maintain the pose, and how to safely get out of the pose. So, for example, with King Dancer's Pose, your standing leg opens up your knee flexor, flexors, the gesture leg, so the leg that is being guided towards your head, 
It works on your hip flexors, your external rotators, your foot dorsiflex. For your abdomen, it works your core, your chest, and your shoulders, ex exteriors, and the elevators, and also your throat as well. It also goes on to stabilize your, your isolated. So for King Dancer's pose, the isolated muscle groups will be, well, starting off with your standing leg, it will be your intrinsic foot muscles, so the inside of your foot muscles, your knee exteriors, your pelvic floor, which is being heavily rotated, your back externers, and we're arching our back, so that is where you feel that in your, your mid to lower back. abdominals, your hip flexors, the internal rotators of your legs, your shoulder flexors, your protractors, and then when the arm is connected to the foot, it's working your internal rotators again and also your elbow externers. It also goes on to list some other asanas that will help guide you. Towards that peak pose, especially King Dancer's pose, this is a very challenging, pretty advanced pose. You see a lot of cheerleaders in this pose, but in yoga, this is also very good for a heart opening. Okay. And it also gives you some counter poses to do as well so that once you are safely out of your pose, you can you know, release and flush out all the toxins that were being removed from the body with that pose. So that is our Mark Stevens Yoga Sequencing Deck. For the Yoga Adjustment Deck, it gives you the hand placements and some diagrams. It's giving the instructor cues on how to guide their yogi into the pose safely again. As far as the adjustment deck, this is so that you can help your, your yogi actually breathe deeper into their posture. And if this is their first time getting into the pose, this is also the prepping so that you can successfully help them as well. So it talks about the verbal cues, which is extremely important in yoga. For example, for the firefly, verbally cue and demonstrate slowly extending the legs, pointing the feet and spreading the toes. Use light hands to cue, pressing the index fingers firmly down. That's just the first bullet point for firefly pose. But here it offers so many different poses, like upward lotus pose. This is an inversion. I just think honestly that this is the best sequency deck ever, like period poo. Like everybody needs to get this. It's perfect for your asana practice. If you were just a yogi and it's even more helpful if you are a yoga instructor as well and majority of the time when you are in your yoga teacher training there are certain poses that won't be touched on or that won't be discussed that you probably don't even know exist so this deck is like really good for allowing your creativity to really start flowing again i did buy our de the decks from off of Amazon like I will go ahead and include the pictures the prices you relatively quick as well I don't have Amazon Prime but the material did get here fairly quick thank um, you so much for watching my video um yes namaste and I hope that you enjoyed